Write this question yourself when you've done it, then watch the clip. Part A. See the gradient, so m is equal to one third. And the coordinate x1 and y1 are 9 and minus 4. Then the equation of straight line is y minus the y coordinate m bracket x minus the x coordinate. Now we substitute the numbers in y minus minus 4 we're going to make plus 4 1 third x minus 9 if we multiply by 3 we get 3y plus 12 equal to x minus 9 take everything to the right hand side we get x minus 3y minus 21 is equal to 0. Part B. Now the equation of L1 is x minus 3y minus 21 equal to 0. And the equation of L2 so the gradient is 0, the y-intercept is 0, so the equation is just y equal to minus 2x. And then we substitute for y minus 2x. So x minus 3 times 2x minus 21 equal to 0. So that's x plus 6x minus 21 equal to 0. So that's 7x is equal to 21, therefore x is equal to 3. Then we substitute into this equation, y is equal to minus 2 times 3, which is minus 6. So the coordinates of p are 3 and minus 6. Now we write L1 So it's x minus 3y minus 21 equal to 0 Make y the subject, so 3y is equal to x minus 21 So y is equal to minus, sorry plus one third x minus this is twenty one divided by three is minus seven. So therefore the intercept C is minus seven. Now we draw the triangle. So the point P is 3 minus 6. So that's the point there. Point C, so this is P. This is minus 7. Then we find the area of this triangle. Now this triangle, this length is 7 units, and then the height this way, it's just the x coordinate is 3. So the area of triangle is half base times height, 
this so it's half times seven times three that's equal to ten point five units squared.